Now we can relate this back to a demand curve. I mean, have I drawn even a demand curve? I haven't drawn a demand curve yet. So I better draw a demand curve. I would kill myself if I haven't drawn a demand curve by the third lecture. So, so what's a demand curve? What is a demand curve? The economist says, I need a demand curve. What do they mean? What do you put on the axis? You put the quantity of good I here, and you put the price of good I here. All mathematicians hate us because somehow we got the price. Alfred Marshall did that. He put the price up here. So we, we've done that for a long time. Uh, it's OK. <coughs> So this is the demand curve. And the demand curve is a relationship. So this might be a Marshallian demand curve. X, I, M, a P1 up to Pn, and M. All right, so that's a Marshallian demand curve. It holds income constant, holds the price of every good other than good I constant. Right? That is, along this curve, we're varying the price of good I, but holding all the other prices constant. I'm assuming this demand curve satisfies the law of demand. That would be the Marshallian demand curve. Okay. What does the Hicksian demand curve look like in this world? Well, there might be, let's take a given point, that point there, x i naught. If this was a normal good, what would the Hicksian demand curve look like? holding utility constant rather than, rather than income constant. It's going to be flatter or steeper if this is a normal good. It's going to be steeper. It's not going to be as responsive to price, right? Because that second term isn't going to be there, right? That second term, which is the income effect, is making this curve quantity respond more. So the Hicksian demand curve is going to look steeper. X1, X, I guess this should be I. X, I, H of P1 up to Pn. And N. Right? Everybody understand that? Now, there's not just one Hicksian demand curve, right? How does utility compare at this point? to utility at that point? Utility higher or lower at that point? As I move up that Marshallian demand curve, that is holding income and all other prices constant, guy better off or worse off? He's worse off, unambiguously worse off. So this is going to be a Hicksian demand curve corresponding to a lower utility level, right? Right? This should be U. This is, should be U C of well, whatever. U bar. Not. That's the Hicksian demand curve. Where's this Hicksian demand curve? This is going to be a Hicksian demand curve for a lower level of utility. And this is a normal good. Since this is a Hicksian demand curve for a normal good with a lower level utility, at any price I'm going to buy less, which makes sense. There'll be another Hicksian demand curve through that point. That is, there's going to be Hicksian demand curves through every point because these are different Hicksian demand curves. Right? A given Marshallian demand curve is going to correspond to different Hicksian demand curves depending on where you are on the Marshallian demand curve. Higher utility levels as I go down the Marshallian demand curve. People understand that? Utilities rising going down the Marshallian demand curve. All right. People see that? Yeah? There is no budget constraint. This is price and quantity. This is the relationship between the price of good I in the consumption of good I. That's what a demand curve is. Demand curve says, tell me a price, and I'll tell you how much you buy. And the Marshallian demand curve I've drawn 
and I've drawn each of the corresponding Hicksian and demand curves. So every time I pick a point here, I can find a new Hicksian and demand curve. And because this good is normal, the Hicksian and demand curves are going to cross through like that. They're going to be steeper. They're not as responsive to price. Okay? If, if this good was inferior, what would be true? <coughs> Well, the Hicksian demand curves would be flatter. They would still be utility ordered the same way. But because now the good's inferior, as I go up, I'm worse off. But as I worse off, the demand curves are shifting out because I'm worse off and it's inferior. So that's shifting the curves out. Okay. You should play with this to make sure you're comfortable. That is, but that's the picture that you want to think about that relates the Hicksian and Marshallian demand curves. Okay. Any questions that people have? Now I can think about, I can think about when I do 